Soccer 605 here, and I'm here with Christina Wagner with the uh, Dakota Alliance Soccer Club and, and of course, the uh, O'Gorman uh, goalkeeper. Um, boy, this is a lot of fun here, all these little kids, huh? Yeah, it's a lot of fun. It's fun to be able to teach them just the basics and see them as we do the three age groups, see how they've progressed through this system. You know, I always like uh, watching you younger players get in here and coach because, you know, all... Uh, all players who are athletes um, end up owing a lot of people along their way for taking time to do that. And uh, it's so nice to see you at a young age getting in here and doing that. Yeah, it, it really is great to be able to kind of give back to what our coaches have taught us and be able to see these little kids just get a love for the game of soccer like we have. So what's the funnest part of working with kids this age? Um, I think the most fun is when they are really struggling with something and then they just, they're able to just do it and you see them able to do their penguin touches right. They're not doing like back and forth anymore or um, they can do the pullback and that's just, it's really fun to be able to see them like get excited about mastering a skill. You know, sometimes you can actually see that light bulb turn on in their, in their head, can't you? <laughs> that's, that's like the best expression. They're like, oh, yes, I got it. So how, how long have you been playing soccer? Um, I've been playing soccer since I think I was in kindergarten, so it's been a long time. You know, you come from a soccer player. Your uh, older sister, Amanda, had uh, the, the best career a goalkeeper ever had at Augustana, and you're, you're fast on her tracks there. Uh, you know, I, I guess we talked a little earlier, and you're still, uh, you know, not committed or anything, but uh, probably like to play college soccer at some point. Yeah, I think that that would be a really great experience for me. I know Amanda loved it when she was playing at Augie. She loved the competition and her teammates. And she just loved the atmosphere, and she just has a really great love for soccer that she passed on to me. So if I can in any way follow in her footsteps and just try and be as great as she was, then that would be awesome. Well, you know, you, you showed, uh, you know, big-time uh, signs of that uh, this year during that state championship match against uh, Aberdeen. I mean, there were points in the game where you came up with some massive saves that would have totally changed the complexion of that game, but you, uh, you kept them out. Yeah, state tournament, it was a really great time. Um, my team definitely helped out a ton. They were always working hard, and I was glad that I was able to have their backs when the ball got through. Um, the state tournament was a lot of adrenaline, so that's probably where those saves come from. But Well, you know, you know adrenaline does not make a keeper alone. I mean, you got to be able to do it, but I, I mean, you really uh, impressed us, and I, I thought we're a huge... Uh, part of that state championship. So, you know, I, I see the, those great uh, goalkeeper genes in you just like your sister has. Good. I'm glad I can get that compliment. Well, uh, Christine, I'm going to let you get back to your group here, but uh, we really do appreciate uh, a couple things. First, you know, you taking time to talk to us, but um, on, a, on a bigger note, uh, I appreciate so much seeing you young players out here working with these little kids and, and teaching them the right way to do stuff. To, I don't think you could have a higher calling almost than that. Yeah, it's a great time. Thank you.